Welcome to the know. I'm Meg Turney, and please, let's have a moment of silence for Ouya. The console maker is now reportedly for sale. Fortune broke the story this afternoon that the company's CEO, Julie Ehrman, had sent out a confidential email, which apparently didn't stay confidential, to company investors and advisors stating that the company had failed to restructure its debts and as a result was on the hunt for a buyer. I guess they're not Lannisters. I'm sorry, it's not a joking time. Ehrman also let fly that this process wasn't going to be very lengthy, right? And giving our debt holders timeline, the process will be quick. We are looking for expressions of interest by the end of this month. She reportedly sent that email at the beginning of April, so if what she said was true, we can expect that someone will be swooping in for the startup very soon. There's no word of yet on how far the company is in the hole, but they did raise $10 million just two months ago, and that wasn't enough to cover it. So I'm guessing they're in pretty deep. You may recall that when the Ouya was first announced on Kickstarter in 2012, the project raised more than $8.5 million, and in early 2013, they pulled in $15 million from investors. Well, even with all that looming overhead, Urban maintained her optimism for the console's future, writing, We believe we've built something real and valuable. I continue to read the tweets and emails of our fans who play Ouya every day, and our catalog is now over 1,000 apps and 40,000 developers. We have the largest library of Android content for the TV, still more than Amazon. Hells yeah! You know what? Honestly, good job keeping your chin up. Seriously, I love that. Of course, uh, we now pour one out for our littlest console. There's nothing to pour out. I would, though, if I had something, I would totally pour it out for you. So, tell us, what's the coolest Kickstarter project you've ever backed that either didn't happen or happened, but then wasn't what you expected? I once backed a Space Invaders chess set that got canceled because they didn't have the copyright. Still bummed about it. Anyway, list out your disappointments in the comments down below. Don't forget, you get the very best in video games and entertainment right here. So make sure you like this video and subscribe to this channel. See you can know what we know and be in the know on this show. Are you?